Welcome back to your daily news, but without the libtard propaganda. I'm your host, Tardvart. Starting out in Denmark, they're stripping Syrians of their residency and sending them back to Syria. The Danish government has determined that it's safe to send people back to Damascus. So all these Syrian refugees that were there for because they were refugees, are now being sent back because they would ask them questions like, how's your proficiency in Danish? None. How are you assimilating to their culture? They aren't. So they started sending them back. Good job, Denmark. Maryland Trooper fatally shoots 16-year-old. Now, this 16-year-old had an airsoft pistol and a knife on him. And at night, the airsoft pistol looked like a real pistol. And when he took a shooting stance at the officer, the officer shot him. And the kid was trying to get back up. And he pulled out a knife. And the officer shot him again and killed him. And now, because there's been no protests, no riots, and they won't reveal the name or the race of the person, obviously, the kid was white. So this will be dead news probably even before I post this video. Protesters gather at Brooklyn Center Police Station hours after ex-officer is charged in death of Duante Wright. Now, if you look at the rap sheet of this guy, all I'm saying is we lost a good one. Rest in peace, King. But they got what they wanted. She's been arrested. She's in jail. She will go through the process now. So why are they still protesting? Why are they still looting? Why are they still burning stuff? Juan Pinasola fails upward. He was a he worked for the DNC here in Florida, and he fucked everything up royally. He screwed them hard, and now he's been promoted and gets to go work with Yang in New York because in the DNC you can only fail upwards. Idris Elba's Luther doesn't feel authentic as a black lead, says the BBC diversity chief. See, in the TV show in England, he had too many white friends. And he didn't eat at the right restaurants. So he's not actually a black person. That's what the person who's been paid six figures by their government to be diversity has decided. So fucking stupid. John Cleese says he'd like to apologize for Monty Python sketches making fun of white English people. He was making fun of that Greg Azaria, whatever his name, the guy who played a poo, who did a really good job. And he's like, oh, I'm white. I shouldn't be playing a brown character in a cartoon. Fucking 2021 stuff. Anyways, that's been your daily news. But without the libtard propaganda, I'm your host, Tardvark.